Hello friends, this video we are going to calculate the break even point in unit or in rupees. How to calculate this one? This is the given information to you. The fixed costs, variable costs, sales in rupees and sales in unit. We are going to solve this numerical or break even point. You can watch the number of videos on my channel Kadam Academy and Industrial Engineering and IoT. Welcome to my YouTube channel Kadam Academy. Now we'll go for the solution of this numerical. What is the given data to you? Fixed cost. Fixed cost is 1200 rupees. What is fixed cost? All costs which do not change with the change in the volume or output like the rent, interest rate, charges. These are the come under the fixed cost. Next, what is given? Variable cost. Variable cost is 4000 rupees. What is variable cost? It's a cost which belong to change with the change in the volume of production. Like material is required, production is increased, fuel required, labor are also increased. This is nothing but the variable cost. What is the given next? Sales in rupees. That means whatever the production were done, product is sale till late for that period 7000 rupees and the sales in units given rupees 1000 don't worry this is a very simple numerical we'll solve within few minutes five minutes now we'll start what we have to do we have to calculate the break even point in units and break even point in rupees these are the two ways we can calculate the break even point only we have studied how to construct the break even point on the break even analysis chart and how to compute it already the different two videos was on this video to calculate in the BEP in units friends this is the formula the break even point in units fixed cost upon contribution the value of this cost is given but contribution margin per unit is not given as this unit of the fixed cost is rupees and the contribution margin per unit is rupees per units. So this rupees rupees get cancelled here. And as this is a per unit, it will come to the here units. So what is the break even point in units? You can calculate from this formula. But contribution of margin per unit, how to calculate? We can calculate by using this formula selling price per unit we required the variable cost per unit we require these values are not given this is the value given in the numerical so how to calculate this one this breaking point in unit fixed cost upon contribution per unit that is the f upon s minus v s means selling price per unit v is the variable cost per unit so friend we'll calculate the variable cost per unit first how to calculate variable cost is given in numerical 4000 rupees and sell price in units is given that is the 1000 so what will the value the rupees 4 rupees 4 is the variable cost per unit it's important next we are going to calculate the variable the selling price per unit selling price per unit we are going to calculate we have to calculate the sales in rupees 7000 rupees is given sales in unit 1000 is given so what is the cost of this uh, sell, selling price per unit is 7 rupees now we have to calculate the contribution margin per unit the sales price in units minus variable cost per unit is 7 minus 4 rupees 3 this is the contribution margin per unit once we calculated this contribution margin per unit we know the fixed cost already given in the data we can calculate the or BEP in units f by s minus v so fixed cost upon contribution per unit 1200 upon 7 minus 4 so what will the 1200 upon 3 in units will get 400 units this is the answer first answer friend next BEP values in rupees we have to calculate that will come to 2803 rupees uh, 2800 3.73 rupees how to calculate this one this is the formula fixed cost upon the profit volume ratio this profit volume ratio we can calculate upon the contribution margin upon the sales price per unit this already we have calculated 
So this converting the in BAP. This is the formula. The fixed cost of the PV ratio. The PV ratio we can calculate. T by seven. That contribution margin three. And sales price per unit is seven. That point four two eight. And the BP in sales value in rupees, BP in rupees, you can calculate fixed cost upon contribution. This PYV ratio, PYV ratio four to eight, and this value fixed cost is already given in numerical. So this upon this, you will get the two eight zero three. So, so friend, this is the simple way we can calculate the BP in sales value and BP in unit. so thank you for watching my video if you are not subscribe my channel please subscribe like and share thank you